So one benefit of taking a language like Arabic on campus is that not a lot of people choose to study Arabic. Um, so the classes are a lot smaller. One term I had a class with four people with a native speaker instructor, instructor which was amazing. My name's Sienna. I recently graduated from the University of Oregon and I studied international studies, Arabic, and nonprofit administration through the 3PM department. And I speak Arabic, Turkish, Italian, French, and English, of course. I'm a native speaker of English. I'm from Ashland, Oregon, so I grew up here. And I'm what's considered a heritage speaker of Italian, so I'm not a native speaker, I'm not fluent, but um, my family speaks Italian, so I learned Italian through my family. I also studied it a little bit here on campus to learn some grammar and stuff. And I learned Turkish through living in Turkey for a couple years um, when I was younger. I learned French in high school, and I started studying Arabic when I came to college. Um, so. Turkish I speak moderately. Um, it was when I was in high school and I lived in Turkey, so I don't remember a lot of it. I took a couple self-study classes here at the UO um, to refresh a little bit, but I would still say my level is moderate for Turkish. French I would also say my level is moderate since I haven't formally studied it since high school. And then Arabic I would say moderate to like advanced low. Um, I studied it formally at UO all four years that I was in school here and I also um, studied it through the Critical Languages Scholarship Program in Morocco one summer. Living in Turkey and learning Turkish made me more interested in the Middle East in general and the languages and culture and history of that region. Um, so I wanted to study Arabic because Turkish is only spoken in Turkey, but Arabic is spoken in the rest of the region. And also uh, there's a lot of jobs for Arabic speakers. So that was a big motivator for why I wanted to study Arabic in college. There's nothing like learning from a native speaker. And even here on campus, um, the classes were really exciting. And I always felt like I was learning so much more um, than a lot of my other classes. <laughs> and the instructors for Arabic on campus really, they love what they do and they love sharing their language. I think the Middle East is such a rich culture and people love their culture and history and language so much that they're just so excited to share 